We are part of a society that is increasingly living longer, and luckily, we are more and more concerned with our health and the health of others. Half of all internauts use search engines to look for information on medical issues, which represents a 30% increase in just 10 years. New technologies provide access to a greater amount of information, and they make it possible for the public to stay informed and to relate in a whole new way with the public health system. This allows us to go further and pose new questions. What eating habits must we change to reduce illness? What can we do to make our cities healthier places to live in? Or how and why does poverty affect the rising number of cases of obesity? It's no longer about curing ourselves when we're ill. We have to know how to stay healthy, keeping disease at bay, and improving our quality of life. The UOC had already begun to research this in 2001 through the pioneering work of Professor Manuel Castells in Project Internet Catalonia. Since then, the university has supported a wide array of research in this field, and it's a trend we now want to make grow and flourish. We want to bring together experts in a variety of disciplines, from not only health, but computer science, psychology, education, economics, humanities, information, and law. Together, we have created the eHealth Center. It is an innovative digital health center that emerges in collaboration with research centers in places like Canada and Norway. And on the center's advisory board, we have representatives from the European Commission, the European Patients Forum, the most relevant hospitals in Barcelona, and the World Health Organization. We need to adopt a salutogenic perspective. That means not only focusing our attention on what makes us sick, but also on what keeps us healthy. Patients are not longer passive, but are empowered. They have knowledge and they want to be active partners in their health, working with professionals in the shared task of enjoying good health. We want to provide them with the tools so that anyone and everyone can take care of themselves, based on scientific evidence. But we also need that health professionals be willing to adapt themselves to this new reality and be able to use new technologies to relate with each other and patients more efficiently. The eHealth Center will make it possible for the government to take advantage of this opportunity, offering new services and making our health system sustainable. UOC has changed the paradigm of higher education by incorporating technology. Technology has helped us to do more and different things not done before. We have moved from teaching to learning by centering the activity around the student. We are going to do something similar with health. Technology will allow citizens to take care and improve their quality of life. People will play the key role of their own health by interacting with health professionals health systems, providers, and technology.